all people of the internet. It is I, the all-talented, the all-handsome, the all-wonderful Squidward Tentacles. And I'm playing Cuphead. I know this seems very surprising to all of you, since I haven't made a video in months and I'm in a completely different channel because of YouTube! Why YouTube? Why? Anyways, I know that Cuphead was, like, came out during 2017, but hey, better late than never, am I right? So yeah. Cuphead, I've heard it's quite the hard game. SpongeBob played it and um apparently he completed 200%. Had all the P ranks, had a lot of S ranks, other oh wait, there's no S ranks, it's A plus. Apparently they're just following like like it's a school grading system or something. Anyway, let's start. This is gonna be new to me, but I'm sure I'll get used to it. Cuphead, don't deal with the devil. Once upon a time, in a magical place called Inkwell Isle, there were two brothers, named Cuphead and Mugman. They lived without a care under the watch of a life of wise Elder Kettle, who is sleeping. <laughs> I could already tell the type of guy he is, Elder Kettle. One day, the two boys wandered far from home, and despite the Elder Kettle's many warnings, ended up in the wrong side of the tracks and entered the Devil's Casino. Oh, that does not sound like a good casino, because it's the Devil's. Inside, found themselves in the crab's table. Hot dogs, exclaimed King Dice, the sleazy manager. These fellas can't lose. King Dice, a bunch of skeletons, alright. Nice run, boys, laughed the newcomer. And, of course, it's the devil himself. Raise the stakes, nope. Never raise the stakes with the devil. It's the devil. Win one more roll and all the loot to my casino is yours. But if you lose, I'll have your souls. Okay, the devil seems more like the Flying Dutchman now. Let's see, grab the dice for throw. Oh, Mugman seems like the competent one here. He has a big nose, so he's very handsome. Snake Eyes, how am I not surprised? Yep, about those souls. And of course, they beg for their souls. That sounds like Mr. Krabs. His soul is an IOU to many spiritual beings. Let's see, Runaway Debtors, so we're gonna have to get souls from Runaway Debtors, uh, Rose Rudely, wait until midnight, that's too short, I sleep at midnight, Elder Kettle, he'll know what to do, gosh that's like Spongebob and Patrick running to Mr. Krabs, whether it's about be Sailor Mouth or the Hooks or anything else at all. What a fine pickle you've gotten yourselves into. The pawns of the devil. I don't want to work for Satan. Oh, I could not imagine my fate at all. Nasty business. Dead or friends won't be very friendly. Terrible beasts. That does not sound good at all. Oh, a potion. It seems like something that will help. Oh, what magical abilities will it do, huh? And plus, how do you even have that kind of ho potion? Um, I, um, well, before you go figure a way out of this mess, you're just standing there doing absolutely nothing. Oh, the tutorial. I guess we'll have to learn ourselves through this tutorial. Duck, hold down to crouch. Alright. Yeah, I'm ducking. I'm the greatest ducker in the world. Jump, use Z. Alright then. Shift to dash. Ooh, dashing. This might, this won't be too bad. I guess Cuphead's like Knuckles. Ha <laughs> ha. Shoot, hold for rapid fire. Whoa. I guess the potion does help. It gave me finger guns. I get to shoot SpongeBob all I want now. See the lock? Alright. Shoot that little target over there. Parry. Alright, let's um jump in midair. Okay. Parry. Come on, Cuphead. Parry, 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 oh yeah, parry, parry, parry. I am amazing at parrying. I'm the best parrier in the history of parrying parries. Alright, there's resurrection, but I won't be playing in two-player mode, because the last thing I need is for me to be playing next to SpongeBob. And for all I know, that guy already finished Cuphead as a pro gamer. 
Come on, if anyone should be pro at this game, it should be me, Squidward Tentacles, because I am the best at everything. Anyway, let's go. Exit. Yep. What to do now? Honestly, I could be doing anything. Painting, playing clarinet, but no. I'm here playing Cuphead using a second channel because my first one got lost and... Oh, mailman. Mail. I, I can't get a mail. Hello there, Mr. Apple. Hey, fellas, looks like you're in it now. Get into trouble. You could shoot too? Oh, three gold coins. Uh, thank you very much, sir. And a shop. I guess I could go buy some Krabby Patties or Kelp Fries. Who knows? Hello there, pork person. Chaser. Heart spread roundabout. Um. Hmm. What to buy? What to buy? I guess I could go for spread. I mean, great damage. I could go for something like that. And I have no coins left. But of course. Goodbye, you pig person with a mustache and an eye patch. You must have went through quite a lot. Purchases, equip card. Hey, don't call me a bum. If anyone's a bum here, it's you, pig man. Okay, there's super, there's charms, there's a list. Oh, I guess that's a list of debtors. And there, my shot B shall be spread. All right, two guns at once. Ain't that something? There's a fake looking tree and... Um, I guess that's a debtor? There's a coin man, a farm... Um, I guess I... Should start with the farm. Spongebob told me that's like the tutorial level or something. Even though we just went to the tutorial, but you know what? Sure, whatever floats Spongebob's big little boat. Okay, I don't think that term made sense at all. Big little boat. Spongebob can't even drive a boat. Whoa, potato man, big potato man. Whoa, oh, ah, I, well, I, um, I know about parrying anything that's pink, but, oh, there, I did it. I failed that first one, ah, you've got to be kidding me. Yeah, take that, dumb little potato. Whoa, giant onion, um, I think now's a good time to try out my spread since it does great damage. Whoa, whoa, what happened? Uh, a tear just dropped at me. That that doesn't make sense. Water can't kill you. I mean, I breathe water. Without water, I die. And also, is it me or is that potato moaning while he's blow while he's spitting out the dirt and all that? Like, jeez, that guy feels. I think that guy needs a lozenge or something. Oh great, it's the Onion Man again. Alright, I'm just gonna try using the EX, 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 EX thing, yeah, EX. Come on, and just avoid the tears. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Those tears, they just jump at me at surprise. They just technically fall at me. Oh, great, now a carrot that's throwing carrots at me. Isn't he technically using his own kind as, you know, attacks? Oh, well. Just gotta keep repeating this process until I beat him. Oh gosh, the guy even has a third eye. That is one too many eyes, sir. Oh, there. He's pulling his hair. I, or his leaves, or whatever it is. This, why are inanimate objects and food alive? It's a cup. A cup is alive. A kettle is alive. A dice is alive. What, what is our world these days? A minus, oh no, 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 that deserves an A plus. I could have died there. Onions crying with deadly tears, potatoes spitting dirt and worms, and a carrot throwing carrots and doing shooting weird beams. Oh, and there's a coin man. Harumph, I'll be a monkey's uncle if I'm putting my mula on the bank. Devil probably controls it. Spread your gold around. Good for him. That's what I say. Um, all right. Good for you, I guess. Actually, not really. Hey, is that fish fishing its own kind? Oh my goodness, that is psychopathic behavior. How dare you fish? You are a menace to our society. All right, I think I'm gonna do a run and gun level now. 
Forest Foley's. All right, let's do Forest Foley's. Let's see what this is about. Okay, so it's kind of like Mario or Mega Man. Yeah, it's more like Mega Man. Can anyone know Mega Man? If you don't know Mega Man, then I don't think we should be friends. Actually, I don't think we are friends. I don't even know you. You're just some random stranger watching this video. Anyway, there's flower people. There's flow pi purple flowers throwing fiery things. There's a mushroom shooting something. That's a weird blue thing I just saw. That kind of looks like a piranha plant. What, what kind of forest is this? Usually in forests, there are plants, trees, and animals. This one, there's plant animal people. There's weird vine things. There's... I question reality. Like, I question it at this point. And are those nuts falling at me? People are using nuts to attack me. Is this Sandy's doing? Is Sandy sending out nuts to try and kill me? How dare you, Sandy? I mean, we're not really friends, and, you know, we don't really hang out as much as you hang out with SpongeBob, but don't try to kill me. Oh, never mind. It's being made by an acorn maker with a flower. Just, I don't know. Okay, just keep going. I have two health left. Oh, I thought there was another boss, but I was wrong. Oh, no. Oh, no. One life left, and there's a bunch of weird chomping things. I need to get out of here. Bravo! Oh, thank goodness. I did it. I went through that. It's probably gonna get harder. A minus again? This is why the American education system is full of bull- <laughs> Great, now there's that disgrace of a fish. I can't even bear to talk to her. Uh, I'm fine, I will. Be gone, spirits, oh wait, you're real. Of course I'm real. I was about to hit you with a parry move. And that's how you deal with ghosts around here. Netwit tries shooting. Mind moving on. Spooking the fish. You're spooking the bikini bottom citizens with what you're doing. <sighs> Goodness gracious. Mausoleum 1. What's a mausoleum? Oh well, might as well find out. Let's see what a mausoleum is. I guess it's like that place where something. Hey look, it's an urn that says help in it. Oh, there's a ghost. Hey, get, get away. Hey. What? You hear me? Get lost. Uh, it's only for the eerie. Yeah, but how come I can shoot it? Oh wait, that fish told me to parry. I still don't trust that fish. Okay, I guess I'm supposed to keep it away from the urn. I wonder why. I guess I'm just gonna parry these ghosts. Hey you, stay away from the urn. I don't know what's in it, but I'm sure it's something important. Get away. Away, ghost. Away, ghost. Oh, you've gotta be kidding me. How many ghosts are there? Another one. This is like a Ghostbuster level disaster. Another one, another ghost. You know, I wish it were this easy to get rid of ghosts. I mean, the problem is they're green and not pink in my areas, but you know, parrying them would be easy. Except, I don't even know how to parry in real life. I'm, I guess I could do it, but I'd rather not. Another ghost here, another ghost there, another ghost over there. Yeah, there we go. Ooh, victory! What did I win? What sweet victory comes upon me? Oh, some weird spirit person. Well, my manners introduce myself. I'm known as the legendary Chalice. Pleased to meet you too. Trapped by these ghosts. Accept a gift. Sure, I could go for a gift. I love gifts, unless it's from SpongeBob. Well, I guess I did like SpongeBob's wood gift clarinet thing. And I just destroyed the mausoleum and I got a super. Ooh, a super. Forget the magical super arts have to be equipped. Alright, thanks, chalice spirit thing. Super art one, energy beam, devastating attack spills. Wow, I could really use that. How do you use a super though? I guess it's like an EX move or something, I, I don't know. 
Anyway, looks like we're going for Goopy Le Grande in Ruse of an Uze. I wonder what this second fight has in store for me. Well, what is that? It's like a weird blue blob thing, uh, and it's bouncing around, okay? I guess this fight would be easy. Just going against the blue thing. Whoa, what? Did you just sneeze at me during the pandemic? How dare you? At least I know it's attacks now. Oh, go! Oh. Ah, darn reflexes. What are you doing now? Oh, parryable question marks. And you grew bigger, you grew bigger, that's not a good... Wait. Whoa, that must be the super. Ain't that a something. Were you gonna... Whoa, you were about to punch me. How dare you. Alright. Uh, and I died. Handsome slime bearing pain one bounce at a time. You are not handsome, that is a small nose. Very unattractive. Ah, oh, great, you're doing it again. You're gonna turn big, come on, come on, come on. Now do attack. Yes, feel my wrath. Okay, now I'm beginning to see why people say I have wrath. Because I know that um, some people made a theory about Spongebob characters, Seven Deadly Sins, something, and I'm wrath. I guess, actually, I couldn't agree more. I like being wrathful-ish. Oh, hey, what happened to him now? Oh dear, Neptune, he just got crushed by a gravestone, and is he the gravestone? Uh, whoa! Good thing I learned about dashing. Spongebob taught me that dashing was important. Whoa! Ha! You can't fool me, little grave. Whoa! I shall be... Oh, you died already. How can a grave die? That does not make sense. Oh well. I am the... Bane of your existence, Grave Blob thing. All right, good results, good results. A plus, A plus, A minus again. <sighs> okay, I think I want to buy Roundabout now. It says it has great coverage, and I have one coin. I don't think that can buy me anything at all. Maybe Kelp Fries, but that guy doesn't sell. Anyway guys, this was quite the game, I really enjoyed it, 10 out of 10, except for it's horrible grading system. Anyway, I think I'm gonna end the video here, thank you for watching, please like and subscribe if you enjoyed, and bye.